Okay. Hey everybody, um, we're back at it again with another video. Um, hi guys. So we're doing a movie review this time on this movie, Don't Breathe. Um, kind of hard to see, but yeah. Sorry about that. Um, so we watched this movie, uh, not too long ago, like about a, maybe a month or so ago. Uh, so this is kind of a late review, but um, basically this movie is about three thieves that break into this blind man's house, but they don't know that he's blind, I believe. And they find this out later on, and try to, they're trying to be all quiet so he doesn't catch them, you know, because he can't see them. Um, so he doesn't know they're in his house. Um, and it stars Jane Levy, Dylan Minnette, and Stephen Lang as the main characters um so what do you think of the movie um i um, think it's pretty good like story based because i feel like wh horror movies with blind people i feel like that just makes it more of a thriller it doesn't it's not really that the movie isn't really that scary it's just kind of creepy to think about some blind man is watching you right but he doesn't he's not watching you it's creepy um also this movie was made by the same director of the 2013 remake of evil dead fede alvarez um and he's very good at doing uh cinematography like set set design and good effects um but we'll talk about that another time because i will probably review um Evil Dead eventually. Um, anyway, all in all, this movie is pretty good. Um, you start to kind of feel bad for some of the characters once you find out more about them. Like um, Dylan Minnette's character, Alex, I think his name was. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, you start to feel bad for him because he didn't really want to do it, but the reason that he did it was because he likes um, the main character, Rocky, who's played by Jane Levy. And, um,. I felt really bad for his character because uh, he didn't deserve what happened to him, but we're not going to do spoilers here because uh, I don't like to spoil things. Um, but basically the movie is really good. Um, it was really good in theaters because it makes you literally sit there and not want to breathe. Like you want to be quiet, went along with the people in the movie. Um, but it's very good. Um, it gave me many heart attacks at certain parts. Um, the twist I did not see coming, but again, we're not going to spoil that, so. All in all, it's a very good yeah, movie. Um, if you were to give it a rating, what would you give it? Mm, eight. Eight out of ten? Same here. Um, there's like little bits of it that are kind of weird and eh, but it's a very good movie. Um, definitely would recommend it. I got it as a Christmas present. Um, and it is certified fresh on Rotten Tomatoes, not that that matters to people, but um, it's a very good movie. So, also, we will be doing another video where we're going to talk about the current reveal from Injustice 2 that happened today in the Shattered Alliance 3 Part 3 trailer. So, we will be doing a video on that and possibly showing the games that I have to see which you guys might want to see me stream also. Just an idea. And also check out the video we made before of all the Injustice 2 characters that have been revealed. Yes, that video is on this channel. And I will leave it in the description. Yes. Alright, so I think that's good. Yeah. Um, that's pretty much all we gotta say about this movie. 8 out of 10. Definitely would recommend. So thanks for watching. Bye guys. Bye bye.